starting off day two. It's a Monday here in England. And uh, boy, it's kind of cool out this morning, but we're actually hunting a sod field here. You can see that the sod's been taken off most of it. And this was actually a Roman encampment at one time, and they had some Roman items found here and some gold found here. That pond you see over there had a lot of gold items pulled out of it from Roman times when they built the pond. And I just started swinging my machine here. I'm using a 600 today. It's such a fast recovery speed. I decided to use it here uh, versus the 3030 and swing high and hard and fast. And my second target, my first target was a pull tab. My second target here today is this thing right here. And I think it's pretty old. It may be an earring of some sort, an old, old style earring or get focused in there something something like that it looks like it's copper brass or it's green color I don't think it's a nail it's got a blunt end on it I think that's a pretty good little fine start hey guys on my very next target check this out it's a toy cannon that is awesome check it out there's the wings where it would have set in the wheels that is awesome. Wow, Roman toy cannon. Wow. That is awesome. Wow. That is unreal. Toy cannon. Wow. Oh man, I am happy with that. Unbelievable. All right, let's get some more. Two holes, two awesome targets. Let's find something else. Hey guys, see it there? I don't know if it's a coin or if it's just a, I don't know what it is, maybe a button. It's getting riding on it. Nope, doesn't look to have it. Just a flat button. Let's see where the shank was on the back, I'm pretty sure here. I don't think that's a coin. I believe it's just to be a flat button. That's still pretty old, though. That's cool. That's a good find. I'll clean it up better later. That's my third target. Three good targets, three holes. All right, let's get something else. All right, guys, down about right here, I dug this out. And it wasn't very deep in my plug there. There it is, big old coin. Let's see if we can find out what it is. Not sure here. I'll rub on it a little bit, but it may be pretty waxed. I'll have to clean it up later. I think I'll let it dry out. But I'm, something's coming through on it here. I may not get a date off of it, but that's a pretty cool find. All right, awesome, super. That's a old one there. We get a date maybe at the cleanup. I'm gonna let it dry out and see if we can get anything off of it. All right, let's get another one. Well, guys, not everything out here is old. Here's the shotgun shell stamp. And it's old, but it's not old old, you know what I mean? All right, modern trash. This is ground that's been around for my gosh, forever, you know, and been at, inhabited for thousands of years, so there's lots of history that's fell on the ground, and this is one of the newer items, probably only 50, 75 years old. Let's see if we can get some older stuff on the next one. Hey guys, I want to show you how big this field is. I started down there where the van's at, and this is a sod field. See how far it goes back behind me, way over in the corner. I've been digging for a while now. I've dug a lot of junk and some land, but I just got something that's kind of different. Looks like a little ranch or something, but I think it's just a little lever off something one time. Fairly old, I'd say. And we'll see if we can get something something else here. Let's see what we can find. 
It wasn't very deep, only about three inches. Most of the targets here I've dug is only about three or four inches deep. So, the holes are cutting nice though, and this kind of sod dirt. It's hard dirt though, but plugs come out real nice. Put them right back in the way they went. All right, let's get another one. Hey guys, check that out. Sun there. Looks like it's gonna be an older air barrette. Clothes pin or something. That's a cool find. All right, let's get going. Hey guys, check this out. Lead button. What is it, letter Peter 1? Pretty cool. Wow, that's neat. Alright, let's see if we can get something else. Hey guys, it's after lunch time now, so just got done eating and I just come out here and just popped this button. If you can get to see it or not. It's pretty cool. It's got some writing on it. Give me a flag, man. Yeah. Check this flag. out, guys. You got a flag. I got two flags today. Jeff just popped this dude out. 1817. <laughs> Yay. That's oh. sweet, man. Good job. Nice. Man. Hey, guys. After Jeff's big old silver, it doesn't seem like much, but it's a button. Looks like old style button too. Got a bent over shank on the back. All right, let's get something else. Guys, down about oh, 10 inches or so was this pulley. It's pretty old. It's kind of cool. I throw it in the pile and we'll go on. Guys, I have no idea what this is. I just popped it out. It's still wet. I don't know if you can see it or not. Looks like it's got a person's face on it. I don't know if it's a trade token or a play token or just what it is. I don't know if you can see it or not. I have no idea. But I'll let it dry out and clean it up and it's awful bent up. I don't know if it's a trade token or a play. I have no idea. But we'll, we'll check it out later. I don't think it's a coin. It could be. Maybe just a token or something. Who knows? We'll check it out later, though. Let's get another one. Hey, guys, check this out. Mike just brought this over. Is that not unreal? Focus on that. Look at that writing on there. That is sweet. Man, that's neat. I'm sure Chris will know exactly what it is. Oh, yeah. Man, that's neat. It's lead. That's awesome, man. Good find. What that ring at? Uh, twelve forty-five. Wow. That is awesome. How deep was that? About seven inches. Really? Wow. That's a great find. Yeah. Some kind of seal stamp or something. I don't know. That is sweet, man. That is cool. Good job, dude. Good job. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. You got it. your good silver and everything, right? <laughs> yeah. Good job. Hey, guys. Check out this buckle. It's pretty sweet. You can see it there or not. The sucker's old. Let's get some more. Hey guys, it's getting late in the day here. And I still haven't got a real ancient coin yet. So it may not happen for me today. Maybe tomorrow. Who knows. But I just popped this button out. Pretty sweet. Pretty old. It's got a nice shank on the back. And got some writing on it. But it's still probably 1800s or older. That's pretty cool. All right, let's get some more. Hey guys, 
There's Jeffrey over there. Got everybody scattered out here. I just dug this target. It's pretty cool. It's a pendant of some sort. You can see a person standing in there. I guarantee you that's pretty old. I don't know what that person's doing. I don't want to clean it up very much, let it dry out, and then I might clean a little more, but that is awesome. That's a cool find. I'm not sure what kind of pin it is. Some kind of shirt pin or hat pin or something. There's a person standing there. You can see him. That's cool. All right, well, let's get another one. Hey guys, I just cut down here just a little bit and pop this out. And it looks like it's going to be an old button. No shank on it. That pretty old one. Let's see if we can get some more stuff. It's getting late in the day. We'll see what we can get. Hey guys, I just got in here. Popped this dude out. Another nice button. Flat button. A pretty old one. Still got the bent over shank on it. Cool. Hey guys, getting towards the end of the day here. Just pulled this dude out. I think it's a military button. I think it's got an anchor and a snake on it. It's a two piece button. I'm not sure how old that is, but that's a cool find. I believe that's what that is. All right, let's get some more.